It's me again. I'm back at it again. Hold on, y'all. Trying to fix it. Yeah. What's up? You know, it's your girl, 3C, back in the building. I am the crocheter that plans and the planner babe that crochets. Right. I blame this haul. You got to blame it on somebody. I blame it on my fairy treasures. Angie went back to Hobby Lobby again. Go, girl. You better go get your yarn. I ain't mad at you. Anyway, I'm going to blame her, and I'm going to blame the second haul on Ginger of the Yarn Geek. Shout out to her. All right. So, midway of watching Angie's video here on YouTube, her, her video, her video, her YouTube channel is My Fairy Treasures. Go over there and check her out. She does jelly plates. She does hauls. She creates bejeweled, pokey, um, you know, the ones that I showed you. She creates it all. She does it all. But she knits. She doesn't crochet. And that's okay. She's a yarny friend of mine, so go check her out. Give her some love and subscribe to her channel. All right. This will this will be called Hobby Lobby and Michaels. What? Right. So, of course, Hobby Lobby has a few things still kind of scattered. If you've been a part of the craze so far this year, the Hobby Lobby hauls for the orange tag. So I got this yarn be cozy with a twist chance of showers. Um, yeah, I got this one because as you guys know, I'm trying to get ready to make this baby blanket for my best friend's daughter. She's having twins. And so I'm going to add this splash of color in between. So I got those two at a dollar 74. That's all the yarn I got from Hobby Lobby. What? Yes, that was it. But, Yarnology and Sewology, 50% off. So, if you want those uh, multicolored crochet hooks that they have or anything else, any type of notions, your tape measure, your scissors, they got them. Half off, 50%. So, I got the 60 pin set. They are so cute. These have little birds on it. Oh my God, so stinking cute. Well, anyway, they were 50% off. This is called Sewology. You'll find these over there in the sewing section. Not in the yarn section. Sewology is in the sewing section. Sans the name. Sewology. So I got two of those. The little pins. Little straight pins. Because I'm trying to finish making my um, stitch marker tree. Yes, I'm making a stitch marker tree. And then I got these labels. I say handmade. They were six in a pack for $1.99. I got those 50% off. Oh, yes, honey. 50% off. Else and otherwise, I probably wouldn't have bought them. Then I got these uh, four D-rings for my purses. And I and I, the next video, I'll come on and show you my finished objects because I finished some stuff. And the safety pins. You, you know what these are for. You put all of your matching stitch markers on it and you can give them away or sell them or whatever. I may have a giveaway. Not right now. I may have one. I don't know. And then, of course, you guys know that I'm always purchasing fabric uh, pieces, remnants. These are called fabric remnants. I go, you know, they're right off from the, the yarn and they're always usually back by a back wall these not really matchy matchy but they going inside of a purse my purse anyway so i got some remnants 
and these were really, really cheap. So it's not that much, but if you put it together, all you need is a square. That's it. That's enough. So I got that. And that, outside of a book that I got from Priscilla Shire, that was it for, all of that was discounted. So I spent like maybe $22, $23 at Hobby Lobby. Now let me tell you about Ginger the Yarn Geek. She did a video and she told you guys, Michaels is not pricing their stuff to show clearance. You're going to have to go and ask them, can you scan this for me and see what the price is? I promise you, this blew my wig all the way off and I don't wear one, as you can see. So I've been looking at this yarn for over a week. And when I saw it, I said, okay, I'm definitely not getting that yarn because it said $11.99. And it was in the back by up under the the old go yarn. You know about that. And I said, cotton cake thing? Mm. But if you go look at Ginger's video, she talks about how Michaels is really not tagging Clarence items some of their items that they've clearance it's in those baskets the homespun is clearance at three dollars it is you can go and check it out but there are yarns that are not being clearance which case in point i'm getting ready to show you i got eight of these three dollars and it says limited time only Limited time only. Funnel cakes are on sale. The funnel cakes. Anything with this blue tag, and she says that in her video, you need to go to your Michaels and just grab them because those blue tags are on sale. These were $3. Now, Michaels is not going to show... On, like it's it's not under a bin that says clearance. It's just sitting and it's priced at $11.99. But when they ring it up, it's going to be priced at $3. So total that I paid for eight was with the $1.98 tax was $25.98 for eight of these. Rondon Walt. To your local Michaels and get you some funnel cakes, baby. This is 100% cotton. Cotton. I hate saying cotton. Cotton is C-O-T-T-O-N. Hallelujah. Cotton. Anyway, it's that bumpy cotton, like the um, cotton DK or yeah, from Hobby Lobby that everyone was calling. So it's that one. Three dollars. I'm telling you, take a look at it. Look for this. You've got to look for that blue limited only. It's just like your the, um, the fleece that everybody has been buying and the baby yarn where it's clearance, but it has that blue limited only. These are limited. So that's my haul. That is my haul. Excuse me. It's, it's 102 degrees here in Texas. So I got to stay hydrated. Anyway, I am your girl. 3C back in the building. Um, Ron don't walk. I, I, forget about Hobby Lobby. They, they're not putting any more. I asked today, are they going to... Because a lot of you that haul some things... My Hobby Lobby did not discount. Things that I showed you, and some things I didn't buy because I went for a specific yarn. Really, Crafter Secret was the main thing that I was going for, and some of the Hanks. So, um, if you haven't been to Hobby Lobby, chances are there's nothing left. Because you have those people that have spent 12 and 13 and 1400 dollars on yarn but that 
I'm not mad at those people because this is the only time of year that they buy yarn, nine times out of 10, because yarn is expensive. And so usually when you have these once per year sales like Hobby Lobby has, you if you're a once per year shopper, that's when you're gonna get it. And so I'm not mad at them, but you have to beat them to the store. So it's your girl. 3C, I am done. 10 minutes. Uh, I am done. I hope you have a fantabulous day. Thank you to all my new subscribers. Thank you. Here's a big hug. Mm -mm. From me to you, your girl, 3C. I am the crocheter that plans and the planner babe that crochets. So, um... Again, run, don't walk to your local Michaels. I'm telling you, those were $3. Got the receipt to prove it. Have a good one. Keep it crafty.